And the winners are... I played card for an hour. <laughs> he played with a card. Look, we're widescreen now, look. Oh uh, yeah, I know, isn't it? We don't have any more problems. <laughs> Call it was Welsh yet. Yeah. What? Call it was Welsh yet, yeah, the other one. I think YouTube should update their um, software. It's YouTube is your fault completely. <laughs> yeah. You, the soul of the internet. Better not put that on because then they can <laughs> YouTube, like, take your videos YouTube off. YouTube demon's going to eat it. <laughs> <laughs> Jake, show, show them the picture you did. You don't need to do that. I can just use my editing skills. Where are you? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so you can get that up there. Right, right there. And then it was zoomed. Well, you can open your mouth. Like, come out your mouth. Okay, show me yeah. that. Yes. Is that good? Is that good? Is that, that footage? Yeah. So. Someone on Facebook is threatening to reveal who the origami killer is in Heavy Rain. And I haven't finished the game yet. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Folded. <laughs> Taste my folded darts of power! <laughs> What's it about? It's about. the others already explained it. it well, you play these these four characters that just get wrapped up in these this... um. Does it explain why he's called the origami killer? Well, because whenever he kills someone, yeah, he yeah. puts their body out in the Thanks open and then leaves the uh, origami in his hand. Oh, right. Okay, okay what has this Take got to do with the advert? The advert's advertising the game? Where that happens in it. When the guy goes up to the shopkeeper. Oh, because, well, that's one of the characters you play, that's an investigator that's investigating the case. So really that has nothing to do with the main storyline? Because the point of the game is, you, any, all your actions can affect what can happen. Right, okay, I see what you mean. I went to the opticians on Saturday. There you go, should I tell them about my opticians? <laughs> Apparently, I should like stop wearing contacts it's so often. worse than my curling Because it's destroying my corneas. Really? Yeah. That sounds quite dangerous. It does, doesn't it? What? The corners of your eyes? Cornea. <laughs> Cornea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But apparently my contacts don't allow enough oxygen to go through to them, so it's kind of like... So aren't you wearing contacts yeah. right now? Yep. It's on the road. <laughs> Okay, so Colin, where did we go this week? Went to Truro. You got some comments. Yeah, we got comments. But you said you liked Civil War, didn't you? Yeah, I got Civil War. And it off. was Ooh. so good. We're going to catch a Western Greyhound bus, which is technically late by about 20 seconds. Colin, you're in widescreen. Win. You look like you're in a film. I am in a film. It's called Quit or Bounce, the epic adventure. Ta da! Do they find it inspiring? Really? I mean, I'd probably rather live here than in a big city. Where are we going? We're in Truro. The magnificent city of Truro. We've gone for the chicken teriyaki with barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How was your day? Mm -hmm. He's on the phone, Jake. Green Spurs. Who? Green Spurs. Green Spurs. What's your name? She was talking about cats and wafers. Wafer cat, wafer cat. Yeah. Just repeat it. <laughs> right, anyway. We're here in Toronto. We went to Watson's. Yeah, continue. I guess we're the only ones in Cornwall that own a camera, so. If you're filming in the street, you do get looked at. Look at that. We've got Civil War. I heard that's really good. We've got like Iron Man Civil War, Spider Man Civil War. So I also got this. Viking. He has an axe and a sword. I think it's a bit unfair. Axe and a sword. Surely you'd specialise in these. He's a Viking, he's allowed to be like that. What's going on later on, Cam? We're going to be gigging in Weybridge. Hell yeah. At some place called Bridge of War. And it's a battle of the bands. We're going to win. I have a good feeling that we're going to kick ass. Alright, well, good luck. Okay, thanks. That'd be awesome. See you there. No. Back to you, Callum. Thanks, Callum. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. So Jordan's gone to his work, so yeah. he's yeah. there. Yeah. And Kyle's still over at Smith's, so.
<laughs> we had a battle of the bands this week at Weybridge, Bridge on Wall. Here's the footage. And I don't really mind But if I could have one thing I hope that I can find A way to live my life Without all of this pain I could live in peace Oh, I'll be free in What's happening, Gun? Oh, uh, well, we're finding out the result. Result. I have the results about my person. You ready over there? It's my least favourite part of the night. Right, well, here we go. And the winners are. Breeze. Woo! Big round of applause for Breeze, please. So how many of these heats do we have? What are you doing, Tom? <laughs> My mom left me in Weybridge. <laughs> Bye. No, I wouldn't do it. I have a four. Goodbye. Sad memories. That's not fair, is it? No, <laughs> I mean, ah. Uh. <laughs> it turns out we won. We won. So yeah, that was actually the first Battle of the Bands that you've ever won. No, it isn't actually. The source doesn't count. <laughs> it does! We like to believe it does! That was a religious place. <laughs> and we beat it. <laughs> we don't have any fans. We have three subscribers on YouTube. Yeah, Luke's one of them's me, one that of them's you. you. <laughs> and who's the other guy? Luke. Luke. Oh, so, oh, there we go! Well, basically, these ones are just for Luke, so... Hi Luke! Hi How's Luke! Going, Luke? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Thanks for subscribing. So, ne next time there's a game, Luke, you need to come. Yeah. Otherwise we will beat you. Our next one's Surf and Sign Festival. Yes. As always, the number to vote is... West 4050 2 6 4 3 4 3 That could have been more gay. <laughs> <laughs> I think we should spell it out. <laughs> I can't, I don't know numbers. <laughs> the comic in which Superman appears for the first time, Action Comics number 1, was sold this week for a million dollars at auction. Shit. <laughs> I would not pay that for a comic. Would you? Oh Even if it God. was rare and first or whatever. So, a 1938 copy of the first comic featuring Superman has sold for a record smashing one million dollars in New York. How many? There's only like one left. No, I'm sure there's a few left. Maybe not that many. Do you have any? No, I don't have any, Tom. So what's the first ever comic book? Bro? First ever comic book would be Caveman painting on the cave. <laughs> <laughs> that was Tom's impression of Caveman. <laughs> So, we, we're in a unanimous agreement that we wouldn't pay that much for a comic. Yeah, pretty much. No. Yeah, well, I was just going to say text 4050 to 64343 for our vote, because we really need this. Like we said, it's it's difficult to break out of Cornwall, and this Surface Unsigned is a, a big opportunity for Green. He's good at begging. So vote for us, and, and anyone watching this that are in Cornwall, we can do this. We can be your local band, and um, we can put Cornwall on the map. In the music industry. <laughs> it's really music. The yeah, it's already in the map. It's just below Devon. <laughs> but we can put the music version of Cornwall on the music map. <laughs> Problem Sawmills kind of did that. Shut up! Okay, yeah! <laughs> no, Tom, no. Okay, very good. Okay, that's not good.